1934, Ralph Nelson Elliott was in the process of conducting empirical research into the price behaviour of the stock market. This would eventually lead to his discovery that market price action reduces down to a limited set of price patterns, or waves, which repeat at every time scale. Elliott's wave principle is the purest form of technical analysis because it subsumes what latterly became known as orthodox pattern recognition. For example, what others refer to as a pennant is a triangle in terms of Elliott wave analysis. Perhaps the best known technical analysis pattern is the famous head and shoulders top pattern, whereby after an uptrend, an old reaction high, the head, is not exceeded, the right shoulder, and then a reversal takes place through what is called the neckline. In Elliott wave terms, this is most often seen at the end of an impulse wave followed by a correction or perhaps the start of a new downtrend. A clue as to the authenticity of a head and shoulders top and perhaps the start of a new downtrend is if the neckline is broken on increasing volume. The Eurostox 50 index containing the Eurozone's blue chip companies may have completed a corrective intermediate degree wave 2 at the July high of 3451 followed by the initial first and second waves of intermediate wave 3 down. This topping process also fits well into a head and shoulders category, with the neckline having been broken in a hard decline on the 21st of September. That decline, as this chart of the futures contract shows, occurred on expanding volume, increasing the probability that a significant top has been formed. Sometimes, in a head and shoulders top pattern, the neckline is retested in order to kiss goodbye the old uptrend, and so we can't rule out a marginal advance in Eurostox 50 for that to occur. Nevertheless, the combination of the Elliott wave structure and the head and shoulders pattern suggests that the Eurostox 50 index could be on the cusp of a very significant decline. Stay tuned to the European short-term update to keep on top of developments.